No, I wanted to go to... Not there. Oh, Ante, that's it. Will this guy join me yet? Welcome, this is the township of Ante. Say, you must be the leader of the Liberation Army. Thanks to you, I can now call this town by its original name. Now it's my turn to help you. Recruit! Leave it to me. My specialty is saying the town's name. I'll just go ahead and... I'll be at T-Shark Castle. What a character. Yeah, Rob did good. Beat the game in under 10 minutes. That was inspiring. Especially considering that, you know, he has an injured hand. Alright, so anyway, Warrior's Village. There he is. Say, big brother, got anything good? I can tell you know, you have something that's very precious to me. The window rune. Please, can I have it? In return, I'll join the Liberation Army. Thank you. With this, I can become a good stained glass window maker. Oh, Commander McCasual, you're back. How'd it go? Have you found a way to defeat Necklord? You betcha. Take a look at this. Here, say hello. Watch your tongue. Say hello to a human. You say hello. Talking sword? Will this thing defeat the vampire? Of course. Vampires are nothing to me. So he says. They are very much alike, those two. Overconfident. That's wonderful. We are just about to depart for Necklord's castle. Look what that demon sent us. Wedding invitation? Who's? He and Tengar's. If we don't hurry, Tengar will be drained of blood. Chief, we're ready to go. Fine, let's go. Commander McCasual, we'll be going ahead of you. I can't go. I'm still a novice and I'm not allowed to go to war. Maybe I should, like, buy some gear for some of my guys? Headgear, did I just drop one of those off at the... Oh, I did. Yeah, we'll have, have one. Dragon armor. Ooh, expensive. One cave of darkness. Well. Let's get to... Uh, let's see. I'll buy three of them. Yeah. I'll move some gear around. He's got to get rid of something. Alright, so. Buy one more. I want my front row to be well fortified. Ah, he quit. might want. Another armor? I don't want it. No. Would I only quit from him? Oh, magic robot. I'll use it to... Kasumi. Oh, Kasumi should have this, actually. Actually, no, Cleo should have that, because she needs a speed boost. Alright, good. Great. I might want to drop off some stuff in storage at the castle, though. Yeah, did I at least see what they have for sale at the item shop? Soon to find some blue seeds. Keyboard. 
Anybody new in here? No. Wait, hang on. Did I, did I go over here before? Alright, there's nothing. Stream frozen? Shouldn't be. According to my end, everything looks good. But if anyone else uh, is having an issue, make sure to let me know. We stayed. Now we gotta get some stuff off in storage. Space. Oh, wait a minute, headgear. Didn't I buy that and I was supposed to put it on there? I think I did. Well, I'll get to check in a minute. Okay. Withdraw. My bad, Kasumi, my bad. Okay. Right, let's drop that off. any weapons? Do I have enough money to do any of that at this point? Oh yeah, one person can. Hmm. Yep, let's do it. Down, I want to save, and I guess I'll head to Necklord's castle. Oh, no, man, it's right there, derp. You know, actually, though, he's the one that needs mega medicines. She's got way too many. She doesn't really need any. Uh, yeah, he needs them. Cause he's the one that's gonna be um, unbalanced like every other turn. Let's go to Necklord's castle. So here you are, Commander McCasual. Let's go, men. Now's the time to show the power of the warrior's village. Yay! My, my, how rude of you to show up at a wedding with all those weapons. Give me back my daughter, my Tengar. I'm afraid not. She's my beloved bride. When the sun sets, our wedding begins. The casual, you're the leader of the Liberation Army, correct? I'd like you to be my most honored guest tonight. If you don't make it to the top of the castle by sunset, Tengar will be mine forever, understood? This gate will not admit the uninvited. Do not make fools of us. Stop! Ah! It appears that what Necklord says is true. Master McCasual, this is a trap. He knows you're our leader. But we have no choice but to go. Commander McCasual, I beg you, please save my daughter from that filthy vampire. Please! 
Wait a minute. Master Mech Casual, take me with you. I'll go too. You can't go, Hicks. You have not yet proven yourself as a warrior. An unproven warrior, one who does not yet carry a sword with a name, is not allowed to enter battle. Can't get off the keyboard. That is a law of our village. It's true that I'm still a novice and not yet strong, but still, I want to save Tengar with my own hands. I promised her. Please, let me keep my promise. Please, Master McCasual. Alright, come along. Thank you. Hicks, come here. Yes, sir. I was waiting for such words from you. You are Hicks of the Warrior's Village, son of Clift the Crusader. I hereby may the birth of this new warrior be celebrated by all. There, Hicks, you have now been designated a warrior. Your courage benefits... Or, sorry, your courage befits a true warrior. Go and save Tengar. Thank you, Sir Zorak. You have now... Or you may now name your sword. Have you something in mind? Yes, I made that decision many years ago. Tengar. Let's go, Hicks. Tengar awaits you. Yes, sir. Reduce membership by one. Oh, Okay, I have to get rid of her, but... Hmm, interesting. Dang it, I want to get rid of her! For him? Oh god, let me guess, he's like a front row fighter. Oh, what level? 38? Okay, that's actually not bad. Alright, not horrible. Anyone got anything, like, to give him? No, because I dropped everything off at the storage. All right, well, he's probably front row, so let's do this. Hey. A zombie fellow. Oh God. That's a lot of enemies there. Ouch. Oh crap, his weapon sucks. Medicine. Action. No. Um, use that medicine. Uh, yeah. He kind of needs it more. Can't get away from my water. Oh, wow. What? Okay, I'm gonna go back and save. We gotta use some mega medicines. Oh, yeah. Uh, or let's get rid of some of these medicines, actually. Starting with this. Where's regular medicines? Him. Give him, actually, some Mega Medicine. Who has more than one? Oh, God. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, give him two. Full helmet. Can anyone equip it? Hey, maybe he could have equipped the full armor. And I got rid of it. Oh, wait. Full helmet. 
Yuck, yuck, yuck. Want to hear something interesting? Please tell me. Yuck, yuck, but not for free. I don't have 10,000 bits. Or do I? Oh, God, no. Forget it. Yuck, yuck, is that all? Well, okay then, but don't tell anyone. Master Necklet always tells us, even in the forest, not just at night, during your work, praise the king. I'll, pay, I'll buy a 300 one. <laughs> now I'll come back later and do the others, maybe. 300 is peanuts. This amount. Don't tell anyone. Master Necklet often calls himself king of the night. Wow. Thanks. Oh god, so much easier than the last formation. Guys, about to gain another level. That's good. Wait a minute. Was it gonna? For a second, there it looked like it was gonna let me go down there. Oh god! All these doors. Earth shield. I guess I give it to Flick. You know what? Hicks can keep it. No. I will give it to Flick, because Flick's a useful character. That's probably gonna save my party. He can give up the steel of shield. Hand over, rather. Uh, Rut row. This time he's gonna do that. You know what? I changed my mind. I changed my mind about a lot of things just now. I'm gonna have McDole get rid of this unicorn. Whatever, I don't care what anyone else does. You get rid of the unicorn. Treasure? Medicine? Was there anything over this way? his uh, membership. I just have pretty good money again. It's not horrible. Wait, is there anything here? No. Oh, <laughs> just this thing. There's 
a painting here called Peasant Girl. Take a look. Click. But click. Did something change? to go to this painting now? No? I might be stuck. <laughs> what went click? Well, I guess I gotta go back, because I don't know where else to go. And if I don't figure anything out by the time I make it all the way back down, then... I guess I'll have to take a break until I figure it out. What if I actually do have to pay that guy money? Free will. I think that's just auto battle. I should really be using that a lot more frequently. I think Hicks is about to gain another level. I hit a switch. What did that do? Yeah. 
Should I have used an escape talisman? Why well, went click when I hit the switch in the painting? I don't even know if I'm gonna go save my game. I can't figure this out. I'm gonna save my game, and then I'm gonna pay the money to see what that guy has to tell me. And then we might just have to continue this at a later time. <laughs> No man. What do? Yeah, I mean, I don't know. It must have been something on that floor I just didn't see. Yuck, yuck, yuck. Want to hear something interesting and then reset your game? Yes. Yuck, yuck. You're very generous. Okay, don't tell anyone. Yuck, yuck. There are some paintings in the third floor. Hall and Master Necklord. Don't look. The second... Oh, no! I went from the right. Stop looking. Oh, God. I have to reset, but that's fine. I'll spend money multiple times, but I hate when this thing like accidentally automatic or accidentally skips like um dialogue. What's this say? Yuck yuck yuck, you're very generous. Okay, don't tell anyone. You see, Master Necklord. Googly goo. You idiot! Yuck yuck, you're angry? Okay, okay, I'll return the money. <laughs> what? Alright, so one more time. Now I reset my game. Alright. I'm not gonna advance the dialogue like quickly this time it's the thing I hate most about Suicode in is the damn text boxes alright there are some paintings in the third floor hall and Master Le Mechlord don't look second painting from the right I said don't look and then third one from the right stop looking alright well let's reset I guess I'll try it like once. Master Necklord, don't look. Second from the right, don't look. And third from the right. Stop looking. Okay. And then click. Oh, the PlayStation 1 sound? It's definitely the best one. For startup. So much better than PS2s and PS3. Yeah, so loud, but yeah. Yeah, better than PS4. Yeah, PS1, best one. I'm trying to remember what Dreamcast was, if it had anything special. Last system you own, damn. Still a great system, though. I mean, it was all downhill from there. <laughs> Did you play Suiko Den on your PS1? Fingertips. Excellent. You did it right, then. Like, I played this game after Final Fantasy VII, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, almost certainly. I mean, it came out before it, but I played it after. And for it to still make that kind of an impression on me... I mean, for my taste, it's a much better game than Final Fantasy VII. People get mad when I talk smack about Final Fantasy VII. Final Fantasy VII could have been an amazing game. If they just got rid of all those damn mini games. Or most of them. And if it actually had, like, characters or a story that I cared about. The gameplay was fine. The graphics and sound were. Well, graphics for its time were great. 
The sound still holds up. Honestly, Final Fantasy VII. One of the all-time great soundtracks. And one of these days I should really go through my old like PS1 RPGs. I got some real gems. How's my money situation? Pretty good, 121,000. Bits. <laughs> it was called Potch in uh, Suikoden 2 and Beyond, is that right? Okay, here we are. Painting here called King of the Night. Take a look. Don't. And second from the right. Don't look. Third from the right. Stop looking. And I guess I do this and then click. I don't know, you guys. I might have to actually look up a guide for this one. Let's try... Let's try this. I think I have to reset the room every time. Well, can I just go in there? You know, I'm just gonna let these enemies go because the thing is... I'm probably just gonna turn the game off anyway. Ugh. That was an accident. Am I doing this wrong? So you cannot look a certain amount of times. Dude! Uh -huh. Click! Alright you guys, I don't know. I gotta study this carefully. Maybe save state practice or... Trial and error. But uh, this is where we'll take a break from this for right now. But don't worry, we're gonna switch to something different next. <laughs>